Discussion on right coronary angiogram with multiple stenotic lesions. RCA shows two lesions, one in the proximal region and another distally just before the crux where posterior descending coronary artery and posterior left ventricular branches originate. That is pre-crux stenosis of RCA. RCA is seen to be a bit tortuous. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Click on the subscribe button. Press the bell icon after that for all updates. Difficulty in passing balloons for angioplasty and coronary stents should be anticipated in very tortuous vessels. In such cases, the guide catheter tends to back out into the aorta when we try to push the device deeper into the vessel. We may need to straighten out the tortuosity using additional stiffer guide wires or use other techniques like anchor balloon or deep throat the catheter in order to improve guide support during angioplasty or stenting. PDA shows three tandem stenosis from proximal to distal region. PDA appears to be a smaller caliber vessel than PLV. This could also be because the vessel is underfilled due to tandem stenosis. Very often the vessel size increases remarkably after opening up the lesions by balloon angioplasty or stenting. This is a right dominant system meaning that the right coronary system crosses the crux, the junction of the atrioventricular and interventricular grooves posteriorly and supplies the posterolateral region of the left ventricle. It may be noted that even in right dominant systems, the major portion of the left ventricular myocardium is supplied by the branches of the left coronary artery. The term dominance means only an anatomical designation of the artery which crosses the crux to the opposite side. Right coronary artery supplies the posterior portion of the interventricular septum and gives posterior descending coronary artery in right dominant system. In left dominant system, left circumflex coronary artery supplies this region. The supply of the posterior interventricular septum is shared by both right coronary artery and left circumflex coronary artery in co-dominant circulation. About 8% of the population can have left dominance and co-dominance may be seen in about 7%. A database of 207,926 percutaneous coronary interventions for acute coronary syndromes were checked in the CATH PCA registry and reported in 2012. They noted that left dominance and co-dominance were associated with modestly increased post-PCI in-hospital mortality in patients with acute coronary syndrome. Here is the journal reference for increased post-PCI in-hospital mortality in left dominance and co-dominance. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for future updates and click on the bell icon for all updates. Thank you.